I think last year is a good example of just the challenges that I face personally from being one of the faces of the league and being expected to perform day in and day out with the national team and on my club team. And I feel like I didn't live up to my own expectations and that was really difficult, but I also felt like I was getting a lot of criticism um, from people outside of the team. It is challenging in its ways, and that's why I feel like I'm so open about confidence and, and my confidence, and if it's not coming from myself, getting that from my teammates, my coaches, my family. And I feel like, for me, if I'm not in it mentally, if I don't give the effort, if I don't feel confident or believe in myself or know that I belong, then you're not gonna perform at your best. Coming into Orlando, I felt eager to get back in with the team and I knew that I put the club in a very difficult position in coming back late, so I wanted to make sure that I was making up for last time. I knew there was gonna be an adjustment level with Marta. I needed to adjust quickly and find my role within the team and find the relationship that me and Marta could have. I know that Marta is a very crafty player. She's a player that draws defenders to her. And in that, I feel like she's created a lot of space for me to be able to run in behind the back line or in front of the back line. And I feel like I'm just able to connect with her without even words. It's something where when it clicks, it clicks. Marta and Morgan, boy, those two looking good together. I feel really good. I feel like for the first time in the US, in a league that I'm able to showcase who I am on the national team. I feel like for a long time, it wasn't able to translate the contributions I made on the national team to my club team as much. But I, I feel like now it's able to translate a lot easier. I'm able to get goals and assists and feel like I'm able to play a complete game start to finish and contribute through the whole game. And that's a really good feeling. It's time to kick. Kick that ball 130 miles per hour. Kick up a sprint every 90 seconds. Kick that heart rate up 167 beats per minute and go 45 minutes straight, no timeouts.